All right, guys, welcome to another episode of Ancient General Fishing. Today I'm going to be traveling into Atlantic Beach, Long Island, New York. It's one of my um, favorite spots, a particular place I belong to. It's a little beach accommodation. Um, I'm going to try from the shoreline with the hope of maybe getting a decent fluke or two or three. Heading over the bridge now. Um, there's some small fish around. I tried the other day, but just they were like weren't much bigger than a sundial fluke. So it's going to be a major undertaking to try to get my desired uh, wishes accomplished today. I highly doubt it's going to happen, but if it does, I'll probably fillet them up and keep them. I'll put them in my freezer down here. Have them ready for a fish fry later on, hopefully. Yeah, the water looks nice. I'm traveling over the bridge right now. I'm going to be using both a bait caster and a small spinning reel. A seven footer is well done, not too small. And I'm going to be dancing gulp off of the bottom stem in the current. Hopefully, the current has calmed down a little bit. It was pretty uh, rough the other day. And just hoping that. There has been an influx of the bait that, like clockwork, comes here every year around mid-June. It got here about a week later, and it was a lot of bird activity, which means that the bait fish are establishing themselves along the um, the actual inlet shoreline. We need to wait for that every year for that to happen, to even have a half a shot at anything. But with that being said, without further uh, delay I'm going to try my best to produce some fish today and um, hopefully something good will happen all right guys um, hopefully it'll be a video if not I'm gonna go out in the kayak tomorrow probably launch from the inlet and take the uh, incoming tide down Reynolds Channel is the name of the place here and uh, we'll see. All right. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If there is one, <laughs> hopefully there is. And um, if not, tomorrow I'll try to produce something decent. All right. Tight lines, guys. There we go. Just cause it was deep doesn't mean it's a big fish, but I hit real deep. Could be a tiny fish too. Yeah, that's a nice fluke. All right, missed the eye, I think. Yeah. I'm getting a little bigger. Oh no, that was a nightmare. I just missed something big, man. I'm laying it right where it was. My home. Yeah, he's back. Definitely not the same fish. No way. No way, that's not the same fish. You kidding me? The purpose of this or oh, at least I didn't get his eye.
official. It's small though, man. Good hook set, no eye damage. What can you ask for? I think the guy's omitting like Comera, Comera, whatever it's called. Ah, it's a nice fluke. It's not a keep it all, I don't think. Although it feels like, ah, it's small probably. They will feel big here. Oh yeah, it's not a bad fluke. Whoa, all right. Attacked by a lot of the flies here. What the hell is this? I took a shower today. <sighs> Alright. Just a distraction to block me from my uh, calling here. One of Lucifer's pets attacking me. There's a fish. Alright, the little weight is, I don't know. It's so hard to tell with this current. Definitely a fluke. Ah, tiny. A friggin' doormat, dude. They feel so much heavier in the water with the current. That was a near disaster. Those birds nested the whole thing. Enough to make a grown man cry. Messed the bait up, that's for sure. Yeah, he mangled the shit out of this. I did lay on it though, but it's not a ball map, it's a joke. It's a tiny little fish problem.
They're definitely here, bro. Fish on. That's a fluke, I think. Yeah, it's definitely a fluke. It's not a big one, though, I don't think. Nah, it's a baby. They're here, dude. <laughs> Certain areas, I'm sure it is, right? <laughs> I had 11 earlier today, but they were small. I had 11 uh, fluke earlier today, but they was they were small. Really? Yeah, on the kayak. Get out of here. Yeah. Tiny, not tiny, but you know. Um, just around around this area in the back over there okay. in the back base. Um, where do you go? You go that way or you go this way? I come from the five town area or out. Okay. But tomorrow I might launch from here. Contemplating it. Because this is the week that typically the big fish pass through. Right. I've seen 10 pounders, 10 plus pound fish caught. Really? Yeah, they make their way through here and then they go to the reefs and they hang out for the remainder of the summer before they go even deeper. Here we go. Fish on. All right. I hope this is one of them, Bob. <laughs> I don't know. The, the current tricks you here, you think it's bigger than it really is. If I even land this fish. Because I don't think I have them hooked well. It's got a little weight to it. I think it's a fluke. I think this might be a potential keeper if it is a fluke. Really? Potential. Just walk it out real slow before I lose this thing. Ah, oh. close. Yeah. Bob, you good luck, man. That's uh, 12. Yeah, you yeah. Got it. That's, si a keeper. that's a keeper. No, it's about 16. No? Yeah, and the 19's a lot bigger. Okay. Uh, Bob, you mind being on YouTube? Huh? You mind being on my channel? Yes. You don't care? Nice. <laughs> Incredible stuff. All right, cool. I'm going to use this footage. Oh, oh shit, I'd hurt him. All right, let me get another one out there. Not a bad fish. Cute little fella. 